RCMP say a 20-year-old souk man has now been charged with second-degree murder in connection with the death of a 53-year-old woman who neighbors identify as his mother. As Kristen Robinson reports, it's not the first time Alex Conte has been accused of a violent attack. A lone skateboarder rides the Souk Rotary Skate Park. It was here that a young Alex Conte honed his skills. In August 2007, at age 16, he was a sponsored rider in the Souk Skate Jam. Four and a half years later, the 20-year-old is charged with second-degree murder. It was horrifying. She was brutally murdered. Conte was arrested Sunday after RCMP were called to this trailer in Park Village on Otter Point Road. Officers discovered a 53-year-old woman dead. Police are not releasing the victim's name until an autopsy confirms her identity. Neighbors say Conte lived in the unit with his mother as he struggled with mental health and drug issues. He had some problems, uh, you know, mental problems, but she stood beside him until this occurred. It's not the first time Conte has been accused in a violent attack. In May 2010, Souk RCMP were called to this home on West Coast Road after Conte allegedly attacked the 42-year-old homeowner with an axe. The injured man escaped to a neighbor's house while Conte proceeded to break windows and trash the house, causing $27,000 in damage. And you see that guy just jump all over here and uh, it's with one ash and just bang on that house and uh, it's, it's come bizarre. My husband just looked like, what's going on? So we called 911, so we called the cop and uh, they just keep going. It's just it's really scary. Conte will be sentenced later this month for assault, break and enter, mischief and uttering threats. In January last year, Conte was arrested and released for mischief and assault. He was rearrested in May for breaching his release conditions and pleaded guilty to the breach, mischief and three counts of assault. He was sentenced to nine months probation. Last October, Conte was arrested again when neighbors say police were called to his mother's trailer. He pleaded guilty to breaching probation and got 16 days jail. It just it bothers me that they don't get help when they're addicts and they need their help. They need help and then they let him go and then he comes back home and now his mom's not around. Conte remains in custody on the murder charge and will appear in court via video Thursday.